In this video, we're going over how to mirror your LG Stylo 5 screen to your TV. Hey everyone, thank you for joining us today. If you want to stay up to date on all the mobile technology coming out and learn cool tips, tricks, and hidden features, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and tap the bell to turn on post notifications so you can be alerted every time we post new videos. Today we're gonna to show you how to mirror that LG Stylo 5 screen to your TV and um, we're gonna keep it short and simple. So uh, you'll need two things to make this work. The first thing is you will need uh, a Chromecast device. Second, you will need home internet for this to work. Um, the method we're gonna show you is wirelessly mirroring your screen to the TV. Uh, and unfortunately, the Stylo 5 does not support what's called MHL, which is being able to plug in a cable to your phone and plug into the TV. So the only way you can really get your screen to your TV is you do have to do it wirelessly. So home internet, Chromecast, and you also would need to have an HD TV that has an HDMI connection. So um, if you check all those boxes, keep on going with us. You're gonna to go to the Play Store and you will need to download the Google Home app. You're just gonna just search Google Home and download this app right here. And we're gonna go ahead and open it up. Now, if you swipe down from the top here, you wanna make sure that your Wi-Fi is turned on and you are connected to your home Wi-Fi. So this should be lit up in blue and you should be connected. If you hold down on the Wi-Fi icon, you can just confirm that you are connected to a Wi-Fi network. So make sure you've also checked that box too. So we're in the Google Home app here. We're gonna hit get started. Make sure you have a Google account linked up to the phone here and I'm connected with Google there. Um, it will ask for location access because it's gonna use that to find the Chromecast. You can accept that. So now we're in uh, to the app and it's gonna show you any de any Chromecast devices that you have connected um, to the internet. So I have one device, it's called the Office TV. That's, so if you have a Chromecast, there's an option to name it. So yours might say just Chromecast, but mine says Office TV. So what we're gonna do is we're going to tap on that device, it says Office TV or actually you want to come down to this one. So we're going to show you two different ways to mirror your screen. The first way is going to mirror anything and everything that's on your TV screen. And the second way is going to only mirror video. So you'll have two options of how you can mirror your screen. So uh, for mirroring your whole screen, you're going to use the bottom option. We're going to tap on Office TV or Chromecast. And then at the bottom of the screen, it will say cast my screen. We're going to tap on that. Press cast screen. And now you should see your Chromecast um, on your TV. Now, quick note, I missed one step. So make sure you turn your TV on. Make sure your Chromecast is set up, obviously. Um, I will have a link in the description below if you don't know how to set up the Chromecast. The quick video that shows you how to do that. Um, make sure you also switch your TV to the input that your Chromecast is plugged into. So your TV probably has multiple HDMI ports. So you might have like cable plugged into it or a PlayStation or something like that. You'll need to take your remote, find the source or input button and switch to whatever input your uh, HDMI uh, Chromecast is plugged into. And then when you hit the cast screen button, you will see it on the TV. Now I can go home you'll see that everything I'm doing is mirrored onto the TV. So I can use this for anything. I can show pictures from a vacation if I wanted to, um, took a video on your phone, want to show it to your family, you can mirror it, show it like that. You can uh, play games, you can show gameplay on the TV. Anything you do on your phone is going to show up on the TV. Now, um, I can also go to YouTube, for example, if I wanted to watch a YouTube video, and I can tap that video and I can also play it. Now, if you want to show it in full screen, you'll just take the phone and turn it sideways like this and hit the little button right here and it will take it into full screen and you could play it right from your phone just like that. So this is how you would mirror your entire screen. Now, it really doesn't make sense. If you're trying to watch a video, this is not the best way to do it. So I'm going to show you another method that works better. Um, 
than just mirroring the entire screen. So if we wanna just end this session here, we're gonna swipe down from the top. You should have an option that says cast screen in your notification panel. Tap on that, it'll take you back to the Google Home app. Or it should, if it doesn't, then you're just gonna go to uh, home screen or go to the Google Home app again. And we're just gonna tap stop mirroring and that will end it from mirroring to the TV. So uh, again, that's option one and that's if you have, if you want everything on your screen to show up on your TV. Now option two I like better, which is I just wanna watch a YouTube video or I just wanna watch a video from Netflix. How do I do that but still use my phone to do other things? So for that method, you're gonna just go to the app that you wanna show on the TV. So I wanna show a YouTube video. And I'm gonna find the video. Now in the upper right corner, you'll see this little icon. This is the cast screen icon. If I tap on this, I can just play this video, not my whole screen on the TV. So I'm gonna tap on my Chromecast, which is Office TV. And now you'll see in a few seconds, it's gonna start playing. And now it's playing right on the TV, but I can still use my phone to do other things. I can use my phone volume to also control the TV volume as well. And again, my phone is still fully operational to do other things. So that's the best part about this second option. And I think this will probably work for most of you guys. You can swipe down from the top of your screen and you can see what's playing here. And if you want to stop that video at any time, you can just tap on the pause or I can hit the X and close it out altogether and that will stop it from mirroring. Now you should be able to do this with just about any uh, video streaming app. So Netflix, uh, Amazon, Hulu, uh, YouTube, all the big apps will have that cast icon in the corner of the video for you to, to tap it and play it right on the TV. Um, and that's it. So I'll have a link in the description below of where you can get a Chromecast if you don't have one. Um, I'll have the video below on how to set up the Chromecast in case you're uh, having issues there. Um, and we'll also have a link to our LG Stylo 5 accessory store so you can find other cool like, cases and stands and, and other cool things to go with your Stylo 5. So I hope you guys did find this video helpful. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if it was helpful. Uh, I always appreciate you guys watching. Take care and as always, have a good one.